Welcome back. I'm here with family physician and sex specialist, Dr. Rachel Ross, who's going to help answer some of your saggy, baggy, and shaggy questions. We're going to get right to our first one. It comes from Sharon in Atlanta, Georgia, who writes, Dear doctors, I've been trying to get my 17-year-old son to pull up his pants regardless of what's in style. I just don't think it's appropriate for boys to constantly have their underwear showing. And I recently heard sagging can cause serious nerve problems in the legs. Is this true? Medically speaking, if you notice how low these, the, the pants can sag, if you have a belt that's consistently constricting across the lateral part of your thigh here, the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve can actually get compressed, and you have young patients coming in with complaints that their feet are going numb, their legs are hurting, and, then, and really the quick fix is to pull up your pants and or relax the, the belt. There's but a nerve. Relax, it's it called the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve, it runs down the side of your leg and it, 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 it's basically sensory innervation for this entire outer part of your thigh. These kids will end up with numbing, numbness, tingling sensation because you're literally constricting that nerve. It, it's, it's a true neuralgia. It's also known as skinny pants syndrome because yeah. the kids who are wearing super skinny pants, if, you're, if your pant is so tight, and women, this is true for you too. Absolutely. You can compress that nerve. Yeah. And you have to, it's, it's, it's a paresthesia. You have mm -hmm. to change your behavior if you're getting that numbness there. Yeah. So that is a, a legitimate concern, right? Yes. But, yep. be, but beyond that, I, I have issues just as a physician, as a citizen, when I have to look at young kids and boys, and we even have a picture of Justin Bieber. You know, they're, they're showing their, like, that's, that to me is bordering on not wearing clothes. And I just, I worry about the message we're sending. You know, clothes are designed to help support things. And imagine me walking around the hospital with my scrub below my, <laughs> you know, it's. You, you it, might get extra dates. I mean, because for, for some reason, not. young people tend to think that this is really attractive. And when they, when they look at where this came from, it actually came from the prisons. Prisoners who actually were interested in other male prisoners would wear their pants low like this so that the buttocks is a little exposed so that everybody knows, hey, you know, I, I, I would like some action. So when you think about where this came from, it really, you know, young men across the country really need to stop and pause. And, uh, and the, the parents who bring their kids in, and this is the main issue, I always tell them, I said, now studies are showing that 70 to 80% of all guys who wear their pants like this are actually starting to have erectile problems. So they're actually starting to have trouble with their erections. So sagging is leading to lagging in the bedroom. You know, this <laughs> has gotten so serious that some businesses, even some towns, are banning people from wearing saggy pants. As men's trousers sag lower, more communities and businesses are passing regulations that limit how low they can go. A Texas shopping mall won the right to ban saggy pants on its property. And in Albany, Georgia, repeat fashion offenders can be fined up to $200. And even though celebrities like his sagginess Justin Bieber celebrate those lowriders, there may be genuine medical concerns, besides airing soiled skivvies, for keeping your pants up. You know, this is ultimately a form, I guess, for a lot of people of personal expression, but I think there's a fine line of personal expression and overexpression. That's why you can't walk down the street, street naked. So I, I think yeah. it's totally fine if businesses want to say, look, pull your pants up. Maybe I'm old school, but yeah. kids, I, I just be aware that these things can have true consequences.